All right, welcome back to another video, guys. I got another review for you. Today, I'm here with my boy, Jordan. Jordan, what kind of car you got? I got a 2006 Nissan 350Z. Here it is. Yeah. And uh, is this the specific color you wanted? It's the best color, at least in my opinion. Oh yeah, definitely. And uh, what year is this? 2006. How I got it was, I was broke. I needed, you know, just something to get me from A to B. I was tired uh -huh. of taking the bus. So I just said, I'll check Craigslist, see what they got. I've been checking on there for a while. And this ad popped up for this car. I was like, oh, okay. It had a nasty wing. But I said, you know what? Fuck it, I'm gonna do it anyway. You took it off. Took it off. <laughs> the guy said seven thousand. I said I'll give you sixty-five for it, right? Wow. That, rule number one on Craigslist: you always have to negotiate. Always gotta, and so he gave it to me just like that. And uh, she's treated me right. I treat her right. So I beat the fuck out of her. And you said uh, you bought it on Craigslist. Were there any other cars you were looking on Craigslist that you maybe test drove or looked into? A lot of them were usually either 2003 Ford GTs or... I think you mentioned Infiniti G35? Infiniti G35 because they're basically the same car. And uh, did you like the Infiniti? The Infiniti was okay. It wasn't my style. I test drove one and it just didn't feel the same when I got into this. All right, Jordan. So a uh, nice shirt, by the way. Thank you. Man. Thank let's you. The, let's see the engine. Uh, uh -huh. Ooh. Tell us a little bit about it. How much? Uh, what are the numbers? Well, it's a 3.5 liter V6 that makes about 287 horsepower, and I want to say somewhere around 260 pound-feet of torque. Wow. Something like that. It ain't the rev up engine. That one makes about. 305, something like that, horsepower. But you know, it's enough for me. All right, now I've been in this car a few times. Jordan's let me drive it a few times. You can definitely feel the power in this. I mean, it's super fun to drive. It's very planted, right, Jordan? That's right, very planted and very nimble. Oh, yeah, definitely. And uh, we'll get to the driving portion in just a bit. All right, Jordan, let's hear those exhaust notes. For sure, for sure. to the driving portion. This thing does handle corners nicely. Wow. Wow. Wow, dude. This thing is so planted. Oh my gosh. I don't know where we're going anymore! <laughs> oh! Oh my gosh! Wow, that was nice. That's so fun! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Do that, Jordan. Never, never, never. So, what made like you want to do that right now? I don't know. I was being filmed. I said, why not? <laughs> How much do you trust this car around the corners? Is I it a pretty it. trustworthy car? Oh yeah, dude. It's reliable. Uh, even around some of those corners, it was the fastest I've ever gone around those corners, and I was surprised at how well it handled. And why do you think it takes corners so well? Well, it's the stance of the car. It's really low profile, and the way that the car was made gives it that nice aerodynamic flow to it. Oh, definitely. And uh, the fat tires definitely oh, help yeah. as well. Definitely. The staggered set, you got like 225 in the back and 245 in the rear, so, you know, it's nice and quiet. All right, Jordan, let me go ahead and uh, get in this. Oh, yeah, man. Wow, 
Oh, look at that. Look at the smile on my face just from doing that. And I love how heavy the steering wheel is too. And uh, Jordan, explain, um, do you think it's very important to have a fun daily? Oh yeah, no, most definitely, man. Like, that was one of the main reasons why I got this car, was to make sure not only could it get me from A to B reliably, uh -huh. but that it was fun. Oh, if yeah. it wasn't fun, then, you know, driving oh, yeah. would be a chore. Oh, yeah. Ready? Ready. Oh, they save the day every time. They ain't sluggish, nothing. Those things stick. It's always good to know and trust your brakes. Oh yeah, no doubt about that. So, um, I give this car a nice solid review. It's a very good beginner car if you want to get into the sportier side of cars. It's a very wonderful car you have to hear, Jordan. Thank you. Thank it packs you. a lot of power. And I, I don't think I would get bored driving this car at all. Oh, I never did. And as you guys know, for the 350Z, 370Z, Nissans are very, um, they have a lot of support when it comes to aftermarket parts. It'll never look like another 350Z because there's so many options to choose from. I just want to say thanks to Jordan for letting me borrow his car today. Oh yeah. Let me fun. drive it, show me around. And um, I'm going to do, be doing a lot more reviews in the future. So go ahead and stay tuned for that. Go ahead and subscribe, like the video, and uh, I'll see you guys next time.